Hi there, I've just been to a mate of mine's sort of junk shop. He mostly deals in lawn mowers and push bikes and uh, that kind of thing. Um, and he does garage clearances. So every now and then he gets some tools um, and then he gives us a bell and I go down and have a look what he's got. Um, he didn't have too much today, but he had a, few, he had a little book, a little bag of tools and bits and bobs. Um, and I ended up buying a few items of him, off him and he gave me a couple of little bits as well. Um, so the first thing I bought off him um, was this um, Dormer set of drill bits previously owned by a chap called Ken. Um, and they're all there. I've got a lot of drill bits, but for Dormer ones, I thought I might as well. And they're not in bad condition and they're all there, even the small ones. Um, and I've had a look and every single one has got the, the Dormer. Oh, it's not really focusing, is it? Is it actually, that's there. there we go. Uh, Dorma um, on it, so 13 millimeter, made in England as well. So that's good. So so I purchased um, um, that off him for a fiver. I thought that was pretty good, really, considering um, the made in the UK. He had two boxes. I didn't buy the other one because I don't need. I've needed two. One's enough. Um, so that was a fiver previously owned by a chap called Ken. That's a bonus. Um, the other two items he, he just gave me, he said you can have them, I don't know what they are. The first thing was this um, Marples, I think it's an angle finder. Um, you put it on your timber and you can mark your 90, 45 degrees, 45, 90. So I thought that was a bit of fun. I did previously have one of these and I gave it away because I didn't know what it was. Um, and then now I know, so uh, it was the one I had was made out of brass. And it was a bit it was a lot smaller so i thought that was a bit of fun so he gave me that so thanks very much for that and he also threw this in he didn't know what it is neither did i and uh, must be for clamping something but i thought it'd be ideal for clamping bits of stock maybe for doing a grind or for a wire wheel get your fingers out of the way so i thought that might come in handy for a restoration to clamp something down so and you can clamp quite big sizes and clamp it down with a wooden screw so he chucked that in, which was good of him. Um, the next thing I purchased off him was for a pound, which I thought was good, was a three-in-one oil, because last week I needed some oil for the um, West Coast Birmingham, England oiler. Um, and I ended up paying two quid, and it was some cheap synthetic brand I've never heard of. So for a pound, I thought three-in-one, I'll have some of that. Um, the next thing I purchased, which was I paid a tenner for, is this World War II, uh, 19, I think it's made in 1943, um, um, pen knife, um, na naval pen knife with an all marlin spike um, and a blade. Um, it, it has got some writing there. I just took a little wire wheel just to see what it is. And I think I'll clean this up and do another video and explain what it is. But it's a World War II Navy um, pen knife all jobby um, and that was a tenner and it's quite big as well so i thought that was a bit of fun so that was it and the other thing i purchased off him um was a large set of punches like this so so he, i asked him how much he had a five or he said three quid to you so i bought those um like long punches i've got quite a lot of punches and um, i'll show you but none of them are long so that was three quid so I thought I'll have a bit of that um, and I, like all the punches I've got they're all quite short um, like all them are quite short and those are more like uh, chisels at the back so I thought yeah I could do with those I haven't got any so and it's not like me not to have anything so yeah so I bought all that junk um, I paid £19 for it £5 ten pound three pound at uh, one pound and then he gave me those two bits which was kind of him um i don't know what you guys think i thought it was a bit of fun so yeah 19 quid and i had a good two hours of chatting in the shop with him which was fun and um and he said that he might be another garage clearance of tools coming in the next couple of weeks so hopefully there might be another video so yeah if you like these videos feel free to subscribe or leave a comment i always answer um, yep, yeah. alright, thanks for watching. Bye.